will most often identify with Jesus and his church is the cross. Today we celebrate the feast of the exaltation of the Holy Cross. The meaning of the cross is deeper than any city, any celebration, any building. The cross is a sign of suffering, a sign of human cruelty at its worst, but by Christ's love shown in the Pascal mystery. It has become the sign of triumph and victory, the sign of God who is love itself. Christians have always looked at the cross in times of suffering. People in concentration camps, in prisons, in hospitals, in any place of suffering and loneliness, have been known to draw rays or from crosses and focus their eyes and hearts on the cross. The cross does not explain any pain and misery. It does not give any easy answers. But it does help us to see our lives united with Christ. of the Holy Cross, also called Universal Exaltation of the Holy and Life-Giving Cross or Holy Cross Day, is celebrated on 14 September to honor the cross on which Jesus Christ was crucified. The Exaltation of the Holy Cross also commemorates the discovery of the True Cross. Legend holds that the relic was found by Saint Helena, mother of the Constantine the Great. During her pilgrimage to the Holy Land around the year 326. The saving events, which is the crucifixion and death of Jesus, his resurrection three days later, in that event lies our salvation, and so it is good to have this feast where we focus on the cross and its saving importance. Dear parishioners, so let us now get to know our sisters more. I, Sister Sangeeta Almeida, belong to the congregation of the Sisters of Mercy of the Holy Cross. I would like to tell you about our existence in this Bhaindar Parish. We, the Holy Cross Sisters, were invited in 1983 by late Reverend Father Bernard Bhandari for pastoral work and to teach in the parish school. Since then, our services are rendered in the field of education and pastoral work. We are involved in the faith formation of students in Sunday Catechism, Holy Communion and Confirmation. We are active members in the various associations of the parish. We visit the families in their joys and sorrows and especially the sick. We are reaching out to those who are in need, be it material, emotional, medical or educational help. Over the years, we have received a lot of appreciation from the people of Bhainda. We are planting the seed of education and nurturing it, especially I as a headmistress 
of our lady of nazareth high school and junior college is doing the best to provide quality education various facilities and have made available opportunities for the students to develop their talents in the field of music learning to play various instruments for example we had a band troupe of primary students of third and fourth standard karate classes classical dance classes and mental math abacus classes etc there are many dreams the sisters have for the people and the students and we believe the best is yet to come sabina murzelo belong to the congregation of the sisters of mercy of the holy cross we are eight sisters in the community sister cecily sister greta sister jessie sister sangeeta sister malika sister archana sister smita and myself as we are living together coming from different background culture languages yet we do live together happily as a superior i am happy to take care of them and their well being i am a teacher teaching in our lady of nazare school and involved in various activities of the parish as a religious sister i am inspired by our founder father tadoshis florentini i need sisters who understand the cross with them i can accomplish anything so these words of our founder inspired me and the source of energy flowed from the divine cross which helped me to face the difficulties and challenges of life and that helped me to see the grain of gold in every human person thank you hello everyone i am sister archana borde i am from nasik maharashtra at present i am in bhindal pursuing my bsw third year from the college of social work nirmala niketan the sayings of our founders blessed mother maria teresa sherrer simply go the way of the lord seek nothing extraordinary inspires me to be a joyful holy cross sister i am happy and proud to be a holy cross sister thank you here we are at the holy cross convent let us step inside to have some fun with our sisters
We often make the sign of the cross over ourselves. We make it before prayer to help fix our minds and hearts on God. We make it after prayer hoping to stay close to God. In trials and temptations, the cross is a sign of strength and protection. We place all our petitions to Jesus, the bearer of the Holy Cross. Our response is, O Holy Cross, have mercy on us. We pray that we may glory in the cross where our salvation was won and to the goodwill of the people that they may respect the cross, a symbol to all the Christians that our dear Jesus who died for us to encourage us to bear the perspective and experience the journey of Calvary so that our pain may be transformed into the moments of joy. For this we pray. Our response will be, O Holy Cross, strengthen us. By the sign of the cross and baptism, Jesus takes us as his own in a unique way. Today, let us look to the cross often. Let us make the sign of the cross and realize we bring our whole selves to God. Our minds, our souls, our thoughts, our wills, our bodies and our hearts. For this we pray. Our response, O Holy Cross, strengthen us. We solemnly pray for the founders and the members of the Sisters of the Holy Cross all over the world for their ministry, their dedication and their service. May they have the strength and courage to succeed in everything they do. May the Holy Cross always be their guide in moments of doubt. For this we pray. Our response, O Holy Cross, strengthen us. We pray for the Sisters of the Holy Cross of our parish, Sister Meena, Sister Sangeeta, Sister Cecily, Sister Dretta, Sister Archana, Sister Smita, Sister Malaika, and Sister Jessie, that through the Holy Cross they may unite with everlasting love and find peace in their faith through Jesus Christ. May they see with compassionate eyes, hear with hopeful ears, and feel with unwavering faith. Surround them with your army of angels to heal their pain. For this we pray, our response, O Holy Cross, strengthen us. In a very special way, we pray for Sister Meena, the superior of the Sisters of the Holy Cross Binder, that she may be a leader of strength, compassion and spirituality. May the blessings of the Holy Cross be with her always to guide her in all her work. Take away all her worries and troubles so that she can give herself completely to the work that you have entrusted her with. Keep her with your kind protection. For this we pray. Your response, O Holy Cross, strengthen us. You do so much for the church, give your whole life for the service of the world, made many sacrifices and expected nothing in return. You help people irrespective of their caste, religion or race. You help in making the world a better place. For all that you do for us, we are all very grateful. We wish you good health and may God bless you. On this great occasion, I, Dion Rebello, take this privilege to wish all the sisters of our convent. May your day be fulfilled with Lot of joy. God bless you and have a wonderful day. Thank you. Dear Jesus, we pray for all the sisters of Holy Cross who have dedicated their life in service to God. We thank God who has blessed these sisters to carry on this vocation selflessly. They are like 
true disciples of God. Lord Jesus, keep them in your presence and guide them whenever they feel left out or in loneliness. We make this prayer through Christ our Lord. Amen. I pray for all the sisters to be blessed with good health and to be safe. Thank you all the sisters because of your kindness, care and generosity are out of this world. That's why we all love you the sisters. In thy home. 